What's going on, guys? My name is Ben Creasy. Um, I'm going to be trying to start a series of just kind of vlogging every day, you know, letting y'all really see my life, which is a lot of vulnerability and a lot of openness to it, which is scary as fuck, bro. But I think that this might be the right decision for me, especially at this point in my life. So, you know, we're starting a little bit late in the day today, um, just because I've been thinking about doing this a lot, you know, and over the last day or so. And I was gonna start it tomorrow morning, but I figured, cause I was driving around and I just kept saying, man, I should just be doing it already. Then the first episode will be today. So right now I'm at work, technically. Uh, they sent me to the store, I'm grabbing some limes. I'm breaking a 50. I hope I have the 50 in my pocket and it's not in the car. Yeah, I do, we good. So I'm gonna walk past <coughs> people uh, before I start talking to you guys again. Let's get over here. So I gotta get a bag of limes. I'm a bartender at the moment at a steakhouse. Um, and I'll give you guys a little bit of footage from you know, bartending tonight. But um, yeah, I'm gonna get some limes and then break it and then head back to work. Good conversation with the cashier lady. Got down about, uh, you know, doing all right. And she's like, I'm okay. And da -da -da. I'm like, anything better than bad is good. She told me that uh, some dude once said, she asked him if how he was doing and he said, I'm upright and I'm not crying. And I was like, hey, that's a, that's a good way to be, you know? <laughs> so we got limes. You feel me? I want to uh, preface this series, right? I already feel like it might be too invasive, you know? Like I feel like after a while, I'm gonna get to a point where I feel a lot of anxiety about the world, being able to see this amount of my life and um, always, always on go, you know? Always living. Um, in a video in a movie type shit like everything is documented and everything is how it is and i feel like that might impact everything more than i can comprehend at the moment however i genuinely feel like it's the best idea for me at the moment for what i want to create so against um not necessarily my better judgment but against everything that tells me that it's a bad idea enough tells me it's a good idea that i'm willing to um, I'm willing to give it a try. So I'm, I'm excited and looking forward to seeing how it goes. So I hope you guys are too. Anyway, I just wanted to come by and let you guys know, you know, some of the, the, the things that go through my mind in regards to this series. I feel like it's going to be incredibly invasive. It's a lot of vulnerability and I haven't been that vulnerable in a while. I've learned to like privacy, which is a big change from how I was as a, as a, a kid uh, so I've learned to like to be alone and have things right now storage that's also something that I gotta I gotta handle I gotta delete a lot of things off my phone and basically just make it like for this purpose you know so I gotta start managing my storage a lot better um but that is those are some of my concerns you know privacy I've learned to like it so giving it up is not an easy task as well as vulnerability I've learned to be a lot more private. I've, I've dealt with the repercussions of being vulnerable throughout my whole life, and I learned to keep shit to myself more. So hopefully the lessons I've learned can help me navigate this process um, better than I would have years ago, where I would actually share every single little thing. Now I hope that there's a, a line between what I will and won't show. So I'll talk to you guys soon. Okay. In the bar, and I've been talking to this guy for a while. You want to tell me your it's... name or anything? What's going on, guys? I'm Mike, and uh, uh, me and Ben have been shooting the shit. Yes, sir. <laughs> Good job. So, I'll tell you guys about what we were talking about later on tonight. But, yeah. Guys, so I just got home from work. Uh, I was only there for two hours tonight. Basically, uh, I sat with that guy and talked a while, basically, um, about he, he's done professional cooking, uh, bartending, uh, all the, the service in, industry and hospitality type things since he was like 12. Um, he's something with engineering now. Uh, but that's not the point. The point is we talked about like, uh, keeping our circle small, how we do that, you know, having the good friends around. I told him about my whole plan with this, which is basically, I'm going to tell you guys. Um, so my theory is if I can, you know, work on my music, work on videos for you guys, while also having a daily vlog series that basically just encapsulates my whole life as I get different jobs, as I do different walks of life, as I go down different pathways, show you guys the ups and downs, really be transparent about my life, then I can have the life I want, which would be that, you know, having a connection with you guys, creating content while also experiencing the world and learning more and more as I go. Um, 
you guys get to see it firsthand. You guys get to be a part of it. We, we get to do this together instead of me doing it and reporting back to you, really. Like, I get to bring you guys with me. Um, the downsides of this is, yes, the vulnerability and the lack of privacy and the the amount of trust that I'm able to give out to new people. Because once the world can see everything in my life, when I'm doing well, people will come in trying to take advantage of that and they'll be able to see exactly what what I'm on, what I have, what I don't, what I want, where, where I'm headed, you know? And they'll also be able to make judgments from a distance and have plans and thought out things to say to me prior to meeting me, which is dangerous, you know? Uh, it makes it a lot harder to let new people in, to trust people. So these are all things that I'm going to have to consider as I go through my life. Tonight, now that I'm back home, um, I'm going to wrap this video up, but I'm going to be filming a video, which is going to be a day in my life, technically. I think you guys are re really going to enjoy that video. After that, I'll probably work on music for a little bit, and I have a plan for making uh, short, t short form uh, content um, that some of you may enjoy, but it definitely will branch my audience out significantly. So I'm going to work on that and get some of those done. Uh, otherwise, today, I got up really late. You know, I didn't really get a lot done today. Um, that's what I'm planning to do now, now that I got off a little bit earlier. Um, but I, I worked for two hours. Didn't, didn't make a ton, you know. But that, that's not the point right now. Right now, we need to instill the future. Um, you guys met him. His name is Mike. Uh, I imagine you guys will see him another time or so, at least in the future and i hope you guys have enjoyed day one um what's the date it's the 9th i believe november 9th 2023 um if it's not it'll say what it actually is right there but i hope you guys have enjoyed if you did be sure to leave a like subscribe to continue to join me on my journey through life and leave a comment if you want to <laughs> have a good night have a great day or a great whatever whenever you're watching this bye guys I said goodbye to you guys for the night, but I have a box that has arrived. I know what it is, and I'm excited about it. They can't see you, but I'm finished. I'm finished show you too, bro. So I'm on Discord with one of my friends. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, that's sick. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, we got this bag right here. I got this bag right here, you feel me? Don't know what you're playing, Mitch. <laughs> All right, let's open this bitch up. You ready? Ooh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. These are new gloves for uh, Muay Thai. 16 ounce, they're Fairfax gloves. This high quality as fuck, from what I found out researching it, which was not minimal, but not maximum amount of research. Oh my god, they're gorgeous. Holy shit. Yo. Yo, these things are fucking gorgeous. <laughs> you like them, though? Hell yeah. They fit great. They need to get broken in, definitely. They're tight as fuck, but they're awesome. And I'll show you guys my uh, other gloves, the reason why I need new gloves. Basically, I got given a pair of gloves uh, to start out with. A nice pair of gloves, but they were a little bit older. Uh, let me just crack the bitch off. Hell yeah. So I hope you guys think they're cool, as I do. I'm very excited about them, and you guys are going to see me fight with these and get my ass beat with these in sparring so hell yeah we can definitely spar but it's just crazy bro you see me you see me excited and you want to you want to talk shit on it it's crazy crazy you gonna get hit once and say all right bet <laughs> he's gonna pop me